Hey, what's up everybody? Rob Marzullo here, Ram Studio Comics. I got a fun little uh, technique and exercise for you to try out. I was studying uh, how to come up with uh, cool like alien or futuristic uh, ships and I came across this and it's, it's a really neat exercise. It's a way to get yourself to think outside of the box. Um, to draw these quick thumbnails, you can see I just kind of speed through this. So now this is a uh, time-lapse video, but each one of these only taking me about five minutes. And what I'm doing is I'm drawing and blocking in some very basic shapes and I'm kind of looking at the silhouettes and trying to see something in the silhouette, kind of like a Warshak test. So basically, you know, blocking in and then see there I'm erasing and taking some away and, uh, you know, kind of filling some details in with white. But keeping it very quick, very basic, um, and, and just kind of, again, trying to see something in the shape of it, not not trying to overdraw it, which I typically do, and I typically take a lot longer to do that. This is a very speed-oriented exercise, and it gets you to think differently about your <clears throat> your drawings, and uh, again, think out you know outside the box a bit. So uh, this one I kind of left a little bit more value and tones in, and I tried to paint in smaller details to uh, somehow create more of a size. I was kind of picturing this being a big carrier uh, type or something you know that would hold a lot more people henceforth drawing in the tiny little windows and little specks for details um, and, and again I this one I felt I almost overdrew a little bit and it didn't come out as well as the other ones the ones that seemed to come out the best in my opinion uh, even though they're not very refined were the ones that I kept really quick and uh, you know didn't think too much about it so um, and then you know another th cool thing about this is when you start defining these shapes, um, you know, you, you kind of start seeing these these components of it that look good and you can just remember those elements and you could even create a brush for it if you wanted, but I, you know, I don't get much into that right now, maybe more in the future. Um, but, you know, like if there's a certain thruster that I might build that looks cool on a fantasy type drawing, I might save that element, you know, and incorporate it into another drawing. And uh, towards the end here, you'll see that I I take a couple of these and combine them and I think that's another uh, key thing you know even how I'm chopping pieces off and moving them around um, things like that just help you come up with new and, and cool shapes that you you know might not have really saw if you were just sketching maybe you know uh, this one I kind of try to picture a bit of a bug shape as I'm drawing it um, and uh, again quickly come into the shape and the form and then trying to see smaller um, you know features inside that shape so at any rate I came across this I wanted to come up with some uh, cool alien futuristic tech stuff for my uh, Blackstone Eternal comic which by the way you can find on Indie Planet of course and uh, be sure to you know like us on Facebook under Ramp Studio Comics but you know I wanted to come up with some cool techie stuff for that so that's why I tried this exercise and I just really enjoyed it I thought it was a neat way to to do stuff like this and I wanted to share that with you guys so Hopefully you like it and you you know you dig it and have fun with it and stuff. So uh, again, keep it quick and basic and, and just think outside the box. So um, be sure to like and subscribe if you don't mind. Let me know what you like. Comment below and uh, you know more videos each week. So I thank you very much for watching. Um, and uh, yeah, keep drawing, keep having fun. Talk to you soon.